Good morning, everybody. Happy Wednesday. Happy Wednesday. Happy update day. How are we doing? How are you guys doing today? I'm doing pretty all right. It's a little bit early for me. I have some lunchtime errands to run, so I'm trying to get this recorded and everything before I have to leave. So let's see how that goes. <laughs> but yeah, happy Wednesday. It's the, what is this, the second week of the Winter Festival. So they've added a couple things to the event, one of them being the um, championship track, which is fun and exciting. It gives me a reason to actually go do the championship track or championships other than the like singular daily. So that's fun. There's a championship in like 14 minutes. So I'm hoping to be ready for that. Also, last time I said that I was saving my hay to, like, craft for the Trailblazer track points, and I didn't even realize that they had gotten rid of the Trailblazer points for crafting, which I'm not too upset about. I'm not surprised that they did it because it was just hay that was giving Trailblazer track. As far as I knew, nothing else was giving you points, so it kind of made sense that maybe that wasn't working as intended. But I'm just doing my daily crafting before getting into everything and checking out the new stuff. I never even realized that it made like a little noise that goes like do 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 when you're done. I didn't know it even did that. How has your first week of the festival been? Mine has been pretty all right. I've just been doing the dailies. I didn't realize until yesterday, the day before the end of the first week, that the penguin race was here. Like the penguin race in Veildale, I completely missed that that race was already here. So I unlocked that yesterday. In case you were missing it, it's here. All right, that is everything I needed to craft, I think. All right, let's take a look at the update. All right, so it's cozy and competitive. Uh, and every once in a while, the little Nis, Nis, Nisa, I don't know how to pronounce it, runs by. Let me see if I can click on him. Okay, it made me log in, but it gave me the 40 Nisa got found code. You should redeem that, or 404 Nisa got found. I've already redeemed it because I saw it on Reddit, but um, definitely redeem it for, I think it was 30 or 40 star coins. Definitely do that. But all right, now we can read the cozy and competitive thing. Um, all right, warm winter wishes, star fam. It's time to get your game face on. So the championship ranks have returned. Um, they're here through the 8th when the Winter Festival leaves. And they're all like holiday ribbons. I think the final one is this reindeer. And you just do championships. You get points based on your placement. And you get ribbons. So do that if you want. The furthest I've made it in one of these things is rank 4. I just lose interest and forget about championships. Like, if we make it to the one in 10 minutes, I will be surprised because I forget immediately. All right, calm in the village. Chill out activities. So there's the gnomes. Uh, the magical horses are walking around. And don't forget to get your gifts. Then the winter shops. So they've added the antique boutique with some classic favorites. Next week, they're going to bring the final flurry discounts. So that's the shop full of items that are going to retire after this year. And the New Year's shops will join the Winter Village. Uh, but they're not coming until like the last week of the festival. Like right before New Year. Okay. And then next week, the four new coat variations are coming out. Two Norkers and two Frisian Sport Horses. I'm pretty excited about them. And also this week, I think that the magical horses are back so that was just a quick little read yeah there wasn't a whole lot here championship ranks are here they've added some more dailies to the winter village and some more shops and that's it they didn't even say they brought the other magic horses back did they they've stopped by the stables okay maybe that just means that maybe that's them saying that the horses are at the stables okay well let's check it out but first let me figure out what this next championship is I almost forgot because they didn't put this in this week's update as far as I saw going through it, but the Gen 2 Frisians are being retired as of next week's update. So they announced that they were retiring them like a few months ago, 
but the date was December 18th and that is the next update. I can't believe they didn't put this in this week's update post that this is the last week you have to buy the Gen 2 Frisians and Frisian Sport Horses before they are removed from the game and cannot be purchased. Obviously you get to keep them if you own them, but this is your last chance to buy one before they get fully retired. So if that's something that you want, definitely do your hardest to make that happen this week because it's your last chance, unfortunately, to grab any of them. So I can't believe they didn't put it in the update, but let's get back to it. Now that I've said I'm going to miss it, I really need to like try not to. Let's head over to Moreland. Oh my gosh, I forgot. I moved my home stable to Dale, you guys. I thought it cost a lot more, but it was only 25 star coins. So I'm still getting used to it being over here and or over in Veildale instead of over here. But I think it'll be better in the long run. And if I don't like it, I can always just swap it back. Okay, what is the next championship? Oh, let me get my daily points really quick. How are you guys doing on the Trailblazer track? I think I'm doing pretty good. I'm almost at 16. I'm like way ahead of where I usually am at this point. All right, so 5.30, Jorvik Stables. So I've got like six minutes. Let's see if I can bust out a dressage, I guess, over here. We're just going for it. I've got no idea. Oh my gosh, trying to lunge while it's snowing is like impossible. I haven't done the dressage since they took the festival away. So I I don't have like any memory of this. Or where I'm supposed to be going now. Okay, I'm going this way. And I don't know if it's any more forgiving than it used to be. Because the new one is pretty forgiving. Oh no. I feel like I that would have normally kicked me out. So maybe it is a little bit more forgiving. I don't know if you guys can hear my cat in the background. But he's very upset that I shut the door. As I, I shut the door since there's people here while I'm recording today. Usually I'm alone when I record. All right, we did it. Good time killer, I guess. All right, off we go to sign up for the race. The championship, it's in two minutes or so. Championship ranks. So we've got Snowflake, Gift, Penguin, Yule Tree. Snowman, Nissa, Nice, and Eric. Okay. I want to get to five at least, I think, to get the snowman. I don't particularly care for this last one. So if I don't make it, I don't care. But the snowman, I think, would be nice to get that one. Isadora's got a fin horse. I love the fin horses, they're so cute. Just a couple of us here for the 5.30 a.m. race. Let's go. I feel like this would be easier to do without the snow, but I think it'll be okay. Oh my gosh, they're so fast. The actual worst part of this whole race. Running through that arena. This is one of the only times of the year when I will actually let my penguin run around because it makes sense that it can slide around when it's like snowy like this. Do I try the stair jump or do I just go the long way? I feel like the stair jump always just messes me up so I'm going the long way. Alright, snowflake acquired. Dude, it's so big. Alright, I'm gonna dump it into my storage. First rank, will I beat the Halloween one and go one more? That would be what I would need to do to get to the snowman, is to go one more. One further. Let's head to the Winter Village now. Although, wait, I should turn in those quests before I forget. I still haven't seen anything about the blizzards. Do we think they're not bringing them back this year? I'm like a little bit sad about that because it was nice to get the tax set from it. But one less thing to worry about. All right, we got some yellow quests. So catch the runaway gingerbread flowers. Oh my gosh. Oh, he's right here. No. Oh my gosh. Dang it. 
Back up we go. All right, Pickle, what's up? The horses are wandering around. We have to take photos. All right, so if you see a roaming horse, take a photo. Oh, it's showing me. Is that showing me where the gingerbread followers are? It is. Dude, some of these guys were so bugged last year. All right, head back to the gingerbread base. All right, little dudes, let's go. I know last year you couldn't run too fast or you would lose them. <laughs> yep, got, I lost one. I guess we're just gonna slow canter our way back. Riveting gameplay. Absolutely riveting. So this quest is back with the knock in the guys on the ice around. Am I almost to the gingerbread place? Yes, it's right here. Ooh, we have a gift to go get. Alright, I've returned the gingerbread followers. I'm gonna grab the gift. What is it? Day 12. Oh, 100 XP. So all the magic horses are back. Very exciting. Why do I feel like we're missing some? Are they not all like shown? Okay, yeah, Brinsicle, Hydroon. They're all here. Oh, and they've even got the Shires. Why does Vettel look like. Why are they all in their non magical coats? I think this is where the coats are gonna be next week. But yeah, all the magic horses are here now. Um, they're a little bit discounted from their original price. But yep, they're here if you wanted them. They're all back as well as they do have the, like, last year they released some special coat colors like this Icelandic and the Shire. I don't know why they're showing them by non-magical coat. It confuses me a little bit, but they're here if you want them. I want to see if they brought any other pets back. Yep, they brought back. They brought the little Aurora penguin. I don't know. I previewing pets always a nightmare. Oh my gosh, look how cute it is! It's so bright. Yeah, all the like little guys are back. The little brown penguin. So cute. Okay, so I already have this bow. But I wanted a tail version of it. Why don't they give me a tail version of this really pretty purple bow? It just feels illegal. I do want to finish this set. I need the saddle pad and the leg wraps. All this stuff's here now. Now let's go check the other shops. I want to see what they wrote back. That guy... This guy was here before... Did they add anything? No, I really like this brown set. The hot chocolate and marshmallows set. It's really nice. Alright, this person, they brought back some sets to them. It looks like like this red, like cherry western set. Very cute. Oh my gosh, when I first started playing, you just got this set for like starting the game. Oh my goodness. You got like this set and like a matching puppy. All these sets that like my other account has, my alt account, or it was my main back in the day. I really like the snow flurries set. I think it's so cute. Ooh, I need to get these bows. They're a unique color. Ooh, I like this blue set. I don't know if I would like ever use it, but I like it. This is fun. I like this like icy blue stuff. And then this is just kind of a nice basic set i kind of want the icy blue set to wear when i'm leveling my like uh gen 2 frisian and then winter wishes set very cute oh, and then there's the gallant glacier saddle okay so they added a lot of things to the antique boutique uh this is the guy that has been here all right Still nobody over here yet. Crisp collections. Nothing new here. Yeah, nothing new added here either. So probably safe to spend some tokens at this point. So we checked the shops. We did a championship. Oh, Silverglade Village Championship. 15 minutes. 
I don't think I'm going to make that one. I will forget completely within the next 15 minutes. The other day I went through and got all the stars here. I still, I had only like gotten one or two. So I made sure to go get all those stars in this zone so that when I do get motivated to collect all the rest of the stars, hopefully I won't have any weird like missing ones. No, now that I've like seen it with the big feet, I like it with the big feet and the ears and stuff. It just feels so little when it's not in its magical coat. All right, um, I'm gonna go turn in that gingerbread quest. I think that was it this week. They just they added the vendors, the horses, the gingerbread dude quest. I guess I could run around until I saw a horse, but, I mean, that's not really a unique experience. It's just a very chill week of additions. It gives you a reason to go do your championships. How do you guys feel about the championship rank things? Do you like them, or do they not motivate you to do, like, anything? They, like, half motivate me, but at the same time, it's not like I use the ribbons for anything. I don't wear them, generally. I don't get FOMO very much with them either. You know, like, I feel like that's kind of the whole point of it is you are like, oh, I don't want to miss out on these ribbons, but I don't really care if I miss the ribbons. So it's not really, like, a big motivator for me to do much. If I, if I see a championship... And I can make it, I I will do my best at that point, but it's not going to really change my gameplay. Dang, where are these magical horses? I think that's it. I don't think I'm going to like run around until I find a magical horse because that could take forever. Finding them just usually ends up being like an accidental while I'm doing other stuff thing. So if I see one, I see one. If I don't, well, oh well, I guess. Oh, there it is. I was about to give up on you. Beautiful. Did I jump so high? That is crazy high. Dude, I'm over here taking thumbnail pictures. All right. I should just call it so I can get editing. Um, Yeah, thank you guys so much for hanging out today. It was a much more chill week. Um, I'm still getting over this, like, cold thing, and if I wasn't struggling with that, I, I really wanted to do just, like, a chatty do my dailies with me because I knew this week was going to be such, like, a chill week of update, but unfortunately my throat is still just, like, struggling a little bit. Hopefully by next week it'll be better, and next week we're getting the new coats. I'm very excited. I love the Norker so much. Um, I'm not the don't think I'm like the biggest like obsessive fan with the new Noriker coats that they're releasing but I think from what I've seen I don't hate them and I'm excited to see them in game and of course that buckskin Frisian goals right there true goals all right so I'll see you guys next week for the next holiday update um please like and subscribe if you feel so inclined leave a comment let me know how you're holiday time is going how you feel about all this stuff and i'll see you guys next week all right bye bye